Hey guys, Nemesis C here, bringing another tutorial. This one is a graphic and sound updated version of the Twilight Forest uh, finding the rare saplings. Because the other one, well, it's not updated. It's still, you know, you can still use it to find the saplings and stuff. But uh, I wanted to do a newer version. So for those who haven't seen this, uh, these robust twilight saplings nor uh they do spawn in the twilight naturally or they you can find them in uh chests in the uh twilight forest sometimes they're in the trees themselves sometimes they're in the like abandoned uh what's called like houses that are like broke down so i mean in here you can find any of the saplings from the the robust to the tree, uh, tree of time, the tree of transformation, the miner's tree, and the sorting tree sapling, and you get a little nice spider spawner. You can hear them usually. You know, I I currently don't have them currently in peaceful. That way, there's less uh, stuff to deal with. Even though I'm in creative, but yeah, I mean. Just gotta be careful about, you know, if you find one of the saplings, because you could end up uh, suffocating basically in the wood. Uh, let's see, anybody in here? Because otherwise, they sometimes the trees have uh, zero to four spawners. So we are currently in um, a 1.710 world of Minecraft, and. This is the one of the newer versions on Feed the Beast. So it works all the way back to 1.54, I believe. That was the... Right there, Tree Transformation. So, I mean, as you can see, they are, they're, they're in there. Let's see. The... Otherwise, it has a clock. I have no idea what this one actually does for the tree of tra uh, tree of time, the tree of transformation. Another one of those where I I'm not sure what it does, but it looks it, they look beautiful. I mean, and then the miner's tree. If there's uh, ores underneath, uh, it'll s pretty much summon them to the the top. You know the the grass, but since we're in a super flat, doesn't really matter. And then we got the sorting tree, which apparently, if you have a few chests nearby within a certain radius, it'll auto sort them or whatever. So let's go to the uh, twilight here real quick, and we can go find the uh. find some of these saplings hopefully all right we're back and just letting things load in because of that I never seen that before it's been a while since I played the Twilight Forest uh, but either wise as you can see these do spawn in the normal I mean there's one over there there's one there you just gotta get lucky and hope for the the uh, the drop in the chest. Otherwise, they do. In the, they're they're here. You just gotta get lucky and find those saplings. I don't know if chopping the tree down gives you more saplings or not. It might. I would think so. It'd probably be one per or something like that. Probably fairly rare. Let's see. But otherwise. Otherwise, the, tw the, the mangroves, the sicklies, they're all fairly common in these little dungeons. Uh, dungeon trees, whatever you want to call them. For the robust. Otherwise, let's see if we got any over here. Because, I mean, after point, I mean, you can pillar up, climb up the tree, dig through the tree, use your... Uh, 
what you call it, jet pack or you know however you are able to fly in the mod pack to be able to you know get to them a little easier. Otherwise, they are just one of those things where you just gotta keep looking. So hopefully we can find one here real quick. Here we go. There's another one. Twilight mangrove. Let's check this one over here. Seems pretty thick. But yeah, like I said, it's been a while since I've played Twilight. I mean, there's a lot more things like that is updated. There was never really a house in the middle of that. Let me check its loot real quick. I remember it used to have a decent amount of chests and stuff. Nothing. Nothing. Yeah, because usually the chests in here were usually kind of garbo. Oh, it's from one of these witch huts. Spruce sapling. But, uh, yeah. And then we're going to talk about the rainbow oak sapling. It's, it was new. It was added since the last time I played. Well, not since the last time I played, but since the last time that video was updated. It's, uh, it only spawns in the rainbow forest biomes. So, basically, I'm going to kind of keep looking at some of these trees... But also look for that rainbow sapling, or, well, technically, yeah, look for the rainbow sapling. So, I will be back. Alright, as you've seen, that one just had one, so, that's, uh, it's very good. So, alright, I'm back to looking for the rainbow forest. Well, here's one more thing. Here's these abandoned uh, houses I was talking about. Let's see, is it? Ha they sometimes have random chests in the bottom, along with these wells. I mean, the wells could have uh, stuff in them too. I think I don't know. I've never really had any real luck with the wells. Apparently nothing in that. But yeah, the wells have different chances. So those are little houses. They just have different chances of having uh, random things in them. So. so let's check one more here real quick. And then we're going to go back to a cut. Yes. Yeah, see that one has nothing in it. So either way, these are the sickly ones, and they don't have the uh, spawners. So yeah, again, be right back. Alright, we're back, guys. And moving a little fast because I put on some draconic armor. So let's, uh, let's just grab an axe. And, uh... Otherwise, these are the oak saplings that you're going to want. There's one right here. Otherwise, these are the rainbow oak, le rainbow oak saplings. They oh, wait. Are these ones now? Oh, they might change the wood up, because otherwise they used to be normal oak. Okay, this stuff has to come off. Otherwise, 
guys, there you go. Some rainbow oak saplings from the oak trees. So, so leave a like, comment, subscribe, all that fun stuff. Until next time, guys, be safe out there and enjoy your saplings in the, from the twilight. Bye.